So last Sunday we talked about tithes and offerings, and I know sometimes folks don't like to have that discussion, you know, about giving. But I hope everyone has covered that in prayer, thought about what we said, looked at the scriptures, and and just keep that in the back of our mind still. Your home church and many churches across the nation have people behind the scenes besides the staff people that are volunteers people that take on ministries such as donating supplies donating uh, resources and and or just being the hands and feet for Jesus in a lot of the ministry groups in a church in fact october next month october is pastor appreciation and sometimes we forget sometimes we forget that the pastor does take on more things than what we realize sometimes the pastor works behind the scenes with individuals to get ministries where they need to be to help support ministries to help ministries move in a direction of growth and ministries need not only tithes and offerings but ministries also need people, volunteers, to give their time, to give a moment of them, just to be there or even share. So I encourage everyone to think about that. Just take a moment to think about what are some ways you, as a person, can volunteer or to give in your home church. That could be anything. Time donation, supplies, needs, prayer. Some groups need prayer. Some groups need someone there. Someone just to organize it, to work on things. You know, there's a lot of things that happen in church, and sometimes it just doesn't get noticed as much. Many people go to church Sunday morning, see that the doors are open, the lights are on, music is playing, welcoming people inside the worship service, getting ready for service. Musicians are ready, the worship team's ready, pastors in the front, ready to go after worship. But sometimes we don't realize how much is involved for Sunday morning. How much is there? How many people volunteer are there? How many staff members are there? So when we think about pastor appreciation, let us remember behind each pastor, there is a handful of volunteers, a handful of staff members that work with them, not only to meet the needs besides Sunday, but to serve in areas in ministries that happen throughout the week. You know, a lot goes into giving. There's more than just giving. There is giving. So pray about it, think about it, and see where God takes you. See where God leads you. See where God pushes you in the topic of giving. Have a blessed day, blessed week. Hope everyone was encouraged by church, encouraged by the message, encouraged by the people in the church, encouraged by the songs that we continue to remember and help us stay focused in his word. Amen. Have a blessed day blessed week, and let us keep thinking, how can we give? How can we encourage? How can we support? How can we be the hands and feet for Jesus? Amen. Mr. Blake here for Discipleship 24-7. Don't forget to check out the description box below. Follow the blog. Follow Facebook. Have an awesome week. Amen.